These are the results of the first night of running the ampere time with the same load that the two AGM batteries. The two AGMs had a total amperage or amp hours of 280. They're both 140 amp hour batteries. And this is them here. So they're running, it's, all that's on this load is a 12 volt fridge that runs overnight uh, without any solar. So you see the batteries dip. And as soon as, here's the solar charging it, the battery gets up to over 14. Um, then it would go ahead and level out. And then at night, the solar dies here. And now we're running the battery. Yeah, right about here, actually. The battery kicks in with no solar input, and it just plummets. Drops down and continues to plummet all night as the batteries are running. And I would wake up in the morning and usually see around 12.3. Yep, 12.36. Maybe even a little bit less, let's see. 12.2. This is the new one ampere time. One ampere time running the same load all night. And look at that, it barely noticed it. It levels off here as the uh, solar panels dissipate. No more sun is coming in, it just drops down here and then it maintains a beautiful well above 13 or just over 13 all night long and runs that same fridge. This is the fridge running all night. This is the fridge running all night on the ampere. Um, but the ampere time is amazing. It performed really well. And that's just one battery versus two AGMs over here. 240 amp hours here, 200 amp hours here. I'm very, very pleased with this battery. I'm going to order another one right now.